All right, so you're new to Twitter, and uh, we're going to try and give you a couple of tips here to help you out. And this is tip number one, using the hashtag. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do a quick search for the uh, tweets that are being sent out by everyone in the group and uh, by hashtag. And so we're going to click on discover the hashtag sign there. And over here in the search string, we're going to go ahead and add our search. You can see I've already searched for it before, so here it is right here. Uh, but I'll type it up here. This is what you're going to have to do. So it's going to be the pound sign. That's what we refer to as the hash uh, for the hashtag ETEC597, our class. And I'll hit enter. And when you do this, you'll notice that I've been sending out a bunch of stuff with that tag. Uh, looks like Sophie has sent out uh, some things as well with that tag. And so you can begin to see, quickly see, um, what is going out with that tag. So you'll notice here, for example, it says uh, EdTechChat, a great new hashtag for teachers. This is something that came across on Zite, and I just pushed it out to, uh, to this particular hashtag. So let me show you what this might look like. I'll go ahead and send a tweet here real quick, and uh, we'll go ahead and uh, do a new tweet, and I'll say uh, testing our hashtag ETEC597. And I'll send that as a tweet. And if we go back over here, and actually I didn't have to leave to do that, you'll notice that in Twitter, that's over here. It'll take a moment for it to show up in the feed here. Refresh this for a moment, and there it is, testing our hashtag ETEC597. So that's, uh, that's how you can go ahead and track your hashtags very easily. Again, if you look at this, you can send your tweets over here. Um, and you can uh, search for other people here under Connect. Uh, I'll show you one other thing real quick. I have everyone set up for a list. And if I click on me, it'll show the lists that you belong to. So if you click on me, it'll show the list you belong to. And at the moment, everyone here should at least belong to one list, the ETEC 597 Web 2.0. And you'll notice that when I pull that up, it just brings up a list of the people who are in the list who have tweeted something and what they've tweeted. So it's not necessarily specific to 5. 97, but you can see here that uh, it collects the tweets of the group together. So that's another way of uh, sorting this information. So there you go. There's two little uh, tips for you to get you started.